Good day. I'm Wisconsin Rapids Mayor Zach Fruink here with yet another community update. Nature and recreation was identified as a top consideration by you, our residents, in the community-wide survey. As such, taking a look at past planning and considering future action is appropriate. Today, over 20 miles of trails or routes are designated throughout our city. However, the connectedness to our city parks is lacking. Last week, the Parks and Recreation Commission met and discussed aspects of the City of Wisconsin Rapids Outdoor Recreation Plan approved in 2012. The plan reviewed our existing park and recreational system in the city. It also pointed to many recommendations to be considered. A few months ago, I suggested we dust off that plan and take a look at those recommendations. After all, why plan if there's to be no action? The two elements of focus at the meeting were the existing Ottawagam trail system and a concept called complete streets. The commission voted to consider additional recreational routes that connect to our city parks and assets throughout our city. City staff will propose new routes at the next meeting. While the city today has both separate recreational trails and designated recreational routes, one way to accomplish new routes without actually building new trails is through complete streets. Complete streets is a term used to describe roadways that are designed and operated to enable safe, convenient, and comfortable access and travel for users of all ages and abilities, including pedestrians, bicyclists, and motorists. There is no one design for a complete street, and it is likely that in traveling, you've seen numerous examples of the concept in other regions and municipalities. Given the diversity of the natural and built environment in Wisconsin Rapids, flexibility in accommodating different modes of travel is essential to better balancing the needs of all users. A good example of a complete streets program in Wisconsin is in the city of La Crosse. In 2012, La Crosse passed a complete streets ordinance and today all corridor projects are considered for incorporating the complete streets methodology. Wednesday's meeting served as an introduction to the concepts and possibilities of implementing a complete streets program to capture additional designated routes right here in our city. It is my hope that future meetings will further the discussion to pave the way for adoption right here in our city. In my State of the City address last January, I spoke to this exact idea. Our recreational assets and our location on the Wisconsin River are uniquely positioned to be expanded upon. With the natural beauty of our city on the river, we're poised to be a destination for visitors and further a more attractive place for residents and future residents. The connectedness of our existing trails and eight city parks located along the banks of the Wisconsin River gives our city the potential for our recreational assets to be some of the best of any city around. Thank you for listening.